Okay, this is a tutorial about repairing a Windows operating system. The computer starts and this is all we have on the screen. It's a blinking white cursor and nothing else. Windows is not starting. Okay, so to fix this problem, first of all, let's restart the computer by pressing Ctrl Alt and Delete. Ctrl Alt and Delete. Then, using this computer's motherboard, I will press F11 to choose where to start the computer from. Press F11 for boot menu, you can see it here. Okay, and select the CD. And I will start the computer from a Windows 7 CD. Press any key to boot from CD. Okay, select the first one. This is running from the Windows 7 disk. Windows Setup, EMS enabled. Okay, Windows 7 Setup is starting. Starting Windows. This is the Setup, not the win not Windows itself. Okay, this installation screen appears. On this page, let's click Next then repair your computer and the setup is searching for existing windows installations on the hard drive and let's see what will it found windows found problems with your computer startup options do you want to apply repairs and restart your computer here are some details and repair and restart Let's click Repair and Restart. The computer automatically restarts. And let's see the result. If the setup of Windows 7 did anything useful. This is the BIOS screen. And after this it should boot from somewhere. But the white cursor is back. So the repairing was not successful yet. Okay, so let's restart the computer. Control Alt and Delete. Press it to restart the computer. Control Alt and Delete. I will press F11 again to boot the computer from the Windows 7 disk. Press F11 for boot menu. It has been pressed. Okay, boot once again from the Windows 7. DVD, press any key to boot from that disk, the same setup, Windows is loading files, starting the setup, the same Windows, let's go here to next, and repair your computer once more, these procedures has to be, have to be done repeatedly, the fixing won't be done from one single step searching for Windows installations and this time we have a Windows 8.1 so Windows 7 discovered on the hard drive a Windows 8.1 installation and let's click next and of course the older Windows can't repair the newer Windows this version of system recovery is not compatible so we can select that one but it won't repair it so let's close these windows and instead let's try a windows 8 dvd boot from a windows 8 dvd the same thing here press any key to boot from cd or dvd so this time we are running from a windows 8 installation disk and the procedure is pretty similar here so let's click next repair your computer so this is the windows 8 disk troubleshoot and advanced options and startup repair and this is the windows 8.1 that was attempted to be repaired by Windows 7 now it's diagnosing the PC and let's see if Windows 8 can 
repair or not the existing Windows 8 installation. The computer has restarted automatically. Uh, let's wait and see the results. The usual BIOS screens are displayed. And the white cursor is still there. Windows is not starting. So the repair was not successful. Okay, let's restart the computer once more. Control delete. Press F11 to boot from the same Windows 8 disk. Do the same repair once more. Troubleshoot advanced and startup repair. And let's try for the last time to repair it. And if it's not repaired, then we have to install another operating system and that's it startup repair couldn't repair your PC